Right, what's up guys? Whew. Just got done loading up the new kayak. Here it is. Cash 130 HD. Basically ready to go. I'm gonna change out one of these lures and I'll be on my way. It's about 5.30 and it is in nice conditions. Wind's about to pick up in a few hours, so I'm trying to get a couple hours in. Get the new kayak, uh, give it a spin. Get the, get my first fish on it. All right, so I'm gonna finish doing what I gotta do, load up, and I'll be out there in about maybe two, three minutes, and I'll strap it to the head, and we'll get going. It looks really nice. I see fish jumping all around right now, so let's go do it. Yes, sir. Uh, all right, guys, let's get this... Uh, New Pelican Catch 130 on the water. Alright. Alright, first sit down. This is this is comfortable. Wow. This is unreal. Alright, so we can't put this we can't put the uh the drive in or the rudder down just yet. Cause we are too shallow. I think we're deep enough. Go ahead and put this rudder in. There she goes. We we're in there. All right, let's get the drive in there. Believe it goes. Try it out, let's try it out. Oh yeah, we're moving. Definitely got to adjust these pedals a bit, though. What's up? This is nice. So far, so good. This is definitely uh, tell it's a workout so far. Let's get up on this thing and try try our casting a little bit. I'm gonna throw this top water up here. So first go on standing. So far so good. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty stable. I'll get, have to get used to standing on it. So far, so good, though. And I'm throwing the top water right now. Just doing the, just walking the dog side to side. And it's zigzagging. moving. Try some drop shots, why not? Drop shot. I haven't caught anything on the drop shot yet this year. Why not? Oh, damn, I have a knot in this braid. Yes, 
slow retrieve on the drop shot. I don't need to do too crazy. I think he has a lot of action. There's a striper right there. All right, drop shot's not working here. Oh, not right now, it ain't. Yeah, that striper right here by the tires. This spook up. There it is. Come on. You hit it too. Damn it. So things zigzagging like that. It's like walking the dog. So you're going back and forth. I just don't really like that noise. All right, so first impressions of the kayak so far is that I absolutely love it. The pedal drive system works great. So far, I'll, I will definitely probably have to adjust it a little bit. A little bit more. I can move it one more this way. Well, not a whole lot of action this morning yet. It's looking like it's looking like 6:30. In almost an hour. Got used to using this uh, this new high drive, and I'm trying some top water. No action. I might go in a little bit on this side, or I know there's some uh, some bass in the shallow. Try that out. See the bass hang out in here because the crawdads are here. No action yet. It'll pick up usually around eight or nine in the morning.
First fish of the day, guys, coming on a troll. Surprise. About average size. Bad. All right, get in here. All right. There you go, guys. First fish of the day. Go, 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 go. There he goes. He down. All right. So that's the first fish on the high drive trolling. There it is. There it is. Yes. Ah, oh, got off. God damn it. That was a largey too, I think. God, and the green and white whack baits too. That must have landed right on his head. He hit that thing on the way down. That's two strikes I missed today. What is up guys? So the battery died, but I swapped it out real quick. And I just want to show you guys. I got myself a nice fatty smallmouth. Nice fatty, look at him. Woo! So we're gonna weigh him up right now. One point nine eight guys. One point nine eight. A little two pound two pound smallie right here. There you go. There he goes, he's off. Nice and healthy. Caught him on the whack em baits. That was awesome. So let me give you a little update on time. We're looking like 8.30 now. Got another one. It's like a little baby largy. Little baby largy. That hook is about to, is like super bent, so I don't want to get too crazy with this fish just yet. A little smallie actually. Another smallie. Woo! Oh, he gulped it. That hook shot. All right. I think we're gonna say goodbye to this whack and bait. It has caught me. This is the same one that was catching me uh, spotties in San Diego. So where's my whack and baits at? About to order some more whack and baits. Actually, I got one green. One green left. Hmm, I got a red one though. Try to see if the red one works. Hmm, 9.30. Cast you here a couple times with these red whack -em baits. There it is, baby. Another smallie. Mm. 
Yeah. Woo! Right. Yes, third smallie of the day. Fourth fish. We don't mess up this baits too much. This is the hardest part of the mouth. Right in the corner. Look at that perfect hook set, guys. Woo! Took off. All right. Just changed batteries and uh, hooked up another smallie. Bounced him. Woo! Another Somali. Right in the top of the mouth, too. It's so funny. He spit out that other Wacom bait that I just threw away. He spit it out of his mouth. That was crazy. The other Wacom bait that I tossed out, he gobbled it up at some point a little bit ago. Woo! This is what, my fourth smallie of the day? Four smallmouth? Two in the green and two in the red? All right, there it is, guys. Put them on back. Oh, I got something here. Something small. Oh, there's two. So there's another one following it. Oh. Oh, they both wanted it. That's awesome. Smallie number five. Right, small mouth number five. All right, three on the red, two on the green for Wacom baits. There was one eating it that had it hooked on, and the other one was trying to take it out of its mouth. That's insane. Oh, I got hooked up. They're hitting it on the drop, dude. Hitting it on the drop. All right. Another decent sized Molly. Here's a little tip, guys. Whack them baits. Things getting all nasty like this, getting all tore up. Just a uh, little snippage. Same crappy Walmart hook, all bent. Oh my god, so bad. And then, then we're gonna take the same whack them bait that we just chopped off the tip because it's all messed up. You got all this good stuff just waiting for us right here. Baits are expensive, guys. Don't just uh, don't just toss them just because uh, you think it's you think it's all messed up. Look how messed up this thing is. Cut the tip off. 
You know what? This is brand new. I caught what? Five fish with this one bait? And it's still going. Five fish with one bait. Alright guys, we are back. Uh, put the rudder away. Alright. Whew. That was a workout guys. Jeez. I did not expect, uh, I mean, you think you're in shape, right? It was a great, great, great day. I mean, only went out for about uh, four hours. I uh, got out about 5.30, 5.45, caught one striper out this way. And then uh, not too much after that, tried a whole bunch of top water early on. Came down and I just kind of basically just drifted and uh, stood up on this kayak and cast it. Got down there about maybe 50 yards past the pier there and just went off on smallmouth the whole rest of the day. I tried I tried the Ned rig with the worm. I tried the uh, drop shot with the fluke, nothing on that. And then, you know what, it was it was the whack and baits that made my day. So I got I got one green and chartreuse left. I got two whites, and I got one red. There it is, that's all I got left. I'm gonna put another order in through Wacom Baits. Got, um, I, I wanna say four or five on the red Wacom Baits, and two on the green and white. Got seven smallies, one striper, and that's our day. It's, uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's before noon. It took me a while to get back. Yeah, it's only 11.18, so we're doing great. Great, good in the day. Get home before noon and uh, have the rest of the day to knock out whatever we got to knock out today, which is kind of a lot. So we're gonna end it here, guys. Awesome, awesome first day on the new kayak. The uh, Pelican Catch 130 did not disappoint. It, I mean, I, I can't think of one thing I, I didn't like about this kayak today. Honestly, um, I have to get used to it. I mean, my legs are a little. I mean, I'm in shape, but man. I was getting a little, they're getting burned. My legs are burning. So, take some practice. And, um, can't wait to get out next time. Probably be next week, unfortunately. Got a busy week coming ahead. But, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and edit some videos and get some videos out to you guys. Until next time, guys. Peace out. This was Hemingway Harbor fishing for today. It's great. Smallmouth city. And uh, I think I found new smallmouth candy. The red Wacom baits. So. Check you guys later. Peace out.